I'm so happy to see you again. This is a, a Friday event. And um, please join me again every Friday for a new adventure. Uh, today, uh, as you probably know already, we are going to talk about pewter and bronze item made, made in France. Um, seven generation of pewter pot makers, would I say? I don't know. They are called Le Potier d'Etain, meaning the pewter pots uh, makers. Um, that's hard to translate. However, last year I was really happy to be able to see where they produce and, and make and solder, put together every little item uh, that we have here today. Um, they have a really large inventory. Um, they, they really do uh, items for smokers, they do items for uh, mm. cooking and etc. etc. Et et we are going to focus only on what we love, our Dex accessories. Here is everything. Um, what I wanted really you to feel is when you step in this whole warehouse, it's gigantic. There used to be about 60 workers long, long time ago, maybe around the 60s, I remember him saying. Um, this is gigantic. They have many, many uh, tables where they, they still have a lot of space and many tables where workers used to put these items together. They have like, these uh, ovens, uh, they have these machines to be able to make the mold. Everything is still intact and it looks so dark and dusty uh, that I thought I was coming back 50 years ago. Um, it was uh, definitely a shock to get in this place. Uh, today, there are only four workers, um, then three full-time, basically. Um, the couple that I met, uh, now I think of it, we become, you know, becoming friends because we really, really spend a couple hours very intense, but we knew each other for quite a long time, so I'm gonna try to relay their, uh, how they work. Um, basically, they start firing uh, and it's kind of in the middle of the week they uh, set the the Thursday to be the, the day where they fire their um, whatever oven um, and so um, they only do this on Thursday put their heavy gloves on and, and outfits uh, it's a high temperature you know pewter melt at 330 degrees minimum and so and then that's where they when they pour on Thursday then the rest of the week they put things together so let's see what they do basically and what I love to talk about is what is really close to uh, and related to Patty Bloom is what we put ink inside these little items have uh, lovely pewter tops uh, this is a screw top and we feel it free of charge when you buy one of the one ounce bottle. This is triangle, we have fleur de lis and garland and we can ship that like this with our ink free of charge. Just select the ink you want. Um, I like also those new bottles, those 15 ml or half an ounce are really handy and you can take them with you because they are very light. Now this is the new design because of New Orleans we wanted something more, um, you know, music related and a saxophone um, that we just put on these bottles. Just made that for us this year. Um, so 15 and 30 ml. Those boxes are cute. I just love those little nib boxes. Of course we had to ask them to put a little uh, saxophone in a nib box right there um, with the nib on top. You can put your peels if you want. Um, so these items can also be made in bronze. So it's a bronzing effect. So how is it made? They pour everything, everything is made with a pewter base, then we bronze the pewter. There's a first step that put a 
kind of uh, like a prep coat. Uh, and then the second will give you the color, the actual bronze color. It's electrostatic. Um, and uh, it takes, you know, a while you have to connect every item to, you know, like the 220 volts and whatever it is and then and, and just the sort of molecules go and get attracted by the item to the metal and then get deep inside the pewter. Um, these pewter, but the base, if you buy an item in pewter, it might tarnish a tiny bit. Um, I don't know because I do have a lot of new product it's very very bright very um, shiny and if I get an item that been touched a little bit a tiny bit more darker and it's normal this that this pewter doesn't is not gonna get so much darker you can clean it uh, just you know clean um, this open your product uh, if you go to your ASR address or whatever uh, that you can use to clean it if you really want to but I like the antique look that's what we are looking for as a matter of fact um i remember one um two three weeks ago um one of uh, our client called us and wanted us to actually put together a setup for his antique desk that he just bought and we kept exchanging pictures and ideas bunching each other what we could put and we you know we just found the perfect setup for him. He wanted letter opener, like this Florida opener. Uh, here will be paired with an inkwell, a classic flip top inkwell, and a dipping pan with the nib in a Florida Lee. If you see the Florida Lee magnifying glasses. Good quality, it's not plastic, it's glass. Uh, we can do setups like this and you can mix and match whatever you want online or colors. The colors of the feather can uh, be selected among seven, eight different colors from white to green to blue, black, etc. etc. Put your own nib on there and experience calligraphy. Uh, modern calligraphy uh, or copper plate nibs, pointed nib will be always shipped standard from the shop then after if you want anything else we open uh we open to give you uh, we have about 60 70 different nibs in stock as you know another selection with a um a dipping pen uh will be this oak finish uh lead opener garland bottle and a really large magnifying glass this is the largest magnifying glass that you see here today will have a really great magnification and will be a magnification of three so me i'm really starting to um i have a lot of trouble reading uh three is really wonderful i don't know if i can show you the filigree does it make any sense like that okay I see. yeah let's see um it's really 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 great and i like the field vision to be the largest um really large so here we go uh, what do we have we have really accessories like the little blotters that you can really reload with blotting paper we carry the blotting paper look on our uh, uh, web page also uh, we cut them for you um, we have them to match this is a filigree and the filigree design will go perfectly with this uh, let me bring that to you <laughs> right there so a filigree design is a quite popular design the fleur de lis uh, is also uh, popular for, fleur, for uh, New Orleans obviously but I, I like the filigree it's very masculine here you will have a set with five bottles we can also fit and feel that for what dollar a bottle uh, for each of these a filigree pen a filigree magnifying glass figure that open everything matches we have florida lee we have garlands we can match we can be uh, more flowery we can be more masculine like a florida lee and all of this exists in bronze accents so if you have a desk where you already already have items uh, made of gold 
you know, items and said, ah, no, my stuff is brown. I like to pair it with bras. Well, you know, go with the bras set up and, and we, we put together something in, in bronze. Um, I, it's very, bronze is really popular uh, because it's a warm, it has a very warm feeling as here. You can see this is a cyclamen. This is a wrap around uh, plants here, the cyclamen, and we pair it with a little base. So this little base, we sell them a lot for fountain pens. They are fantastic. So I'm pairing this one that is actually silver. I could get one silver if you want. That will be, there we go, silver. And you can put, put your fountain pen. It's, it's fantastic. Um, we have also, uh, and where are they? We have also these little items for 10 bucks. We have a li bitty little base that could also fit a little fountain pen on your desk. Uh, do you see well? There we go. So I like the large one for large pens, but uh, you know, when you have a skinny pen, this is great too. It's really not expensive at all. And right there, I'm gonna bring to you all the different dipping pens. These dipping pens have really a perfect weight. Um, like, uh, up. there we go. So I fan them out and we have uh, some Muse teas, the Cyclamen again. We have the coffee bean, New Orleans coffee beans. This is a very, it's my favorite here. And uh, just, uh, I'm taking Chicoe coffee in the morning. <laughs> That's for the information. Um, we have the Fleur de Lis and the Violet. Uh, yeah, here we go. Same thing exists in a bronze if you like it. And the bronze is not gonna change Color. There's not going to be patina whatsoever. It is protected, it is varnished. Uh, so if it's a dipping pen, a quill, or whatever it is, it is all protected and we varnish over. So that's why we need uh, the rest of the week, the Monday through uh, Wednesday, um, to do the, you know, the bronzing. Uh, to put the nibs together, to put the assembly, to put the glass inside the magnifying glass. And they have solders, they have to solder things around, you know. And so um, they do love to train uh, apprentices. It's, that's why it's been doing for years and it's what it will do for the next generation. If you, you know, happen to buy our product, then you're going to support small business. Uh, they, um, bring apprentices that do one week in school and one week in uh, the factory and they teach them everything. So here we go on most of it. So what do we have now? We have also these bases if you don't want to put it flat. I love the, the, um, the quills. The quills that reminiscence of what we used to have on our desks. We used to write with a feather uh, obviously the feather didn't have these um, extremities there, uh, or the sections that we had, they were all feathers, but you know, it looks great and you can change the orientation on your desk and make it the way you want. Um, there's a flower, we, I love this one too, this is really affordable. And for weddings, for a guest book, if you have a guest book, and you do RBM is a one and you want your um, guests to write down the little note of course you don't want them to put ink everywhere so just by sorry I'll show you that it's a ballpoint um, but it's quite practical all right and the famous fleur de lis right all paired with the fleur de lis uh, pen holder and then we have the oak finish right there. I love this one too. It's gorgeous. Yeah, it's uh, more flowery design. All that on your desk. And you can mix match, like I said. And if you think uh, this one will go well with, just do it. All right? Spread everything is possible. Um, well, we try to put down a few sets on the website, but mostly everything will be uh, able to be selected separately. Uh, now on the new, we're getting into new items. Um, these items are 
uh, these pen holders and I'm going to bring that out of the field vision. So this is a new generation that we um, design with them. So since they were able to do the mold on site, uh, the mold is made in elastomer and they pour it in, you know, inside uh, the elastomer mold. Um, this mold probably can do a minimum of 800 to 1000 pour, so there's a limit to, uh, to, to, to how many pour you can do. Um, so every time you may, you may have to redo them when they get older. Um, so this is the new generation and uh, this pen holder uh, fits any size pens. It will be great on your pens. This is called a goddess. You will see it already on our website. And this could be matched with seals. We have a new seal handle. Uh, that we'll show you next week because the new generation will come more next week and all the new stuff but I, I'll do a preview on this one so and um, wait for me I have I should have one here there we go so we can have a letter opener right here to put everything will be placed like this if you want to have the setup uh, we can do this let's find you know a little base for it and we can put a base under this and you set there we go you're gonna you obviously on your base on your on your desk we have the seal coming up the goddess seal will have new design and will be changeable so that's about funny little items I want to talk about like this, the butterfly. The butterfly also is a really cute one. Um, and then we're gonna have more. All of the, I'm not gonna talk about all the design because they're gonna be all listed there from the letter opener horse here, the column, the Greek columns or whatever it is, uh, and all the different, uh, I just have wanted you to have an overview of what we carry, the classics, uh, the very, really classic. And then we go to something a little bit more modern because we wanted to design something that would be uh, more practical um, so we can actually pre-fill those ink wells automatically and then deliver to our client with ink inside. So we're going to show you uh, next week what we uh, created with uh, Le Potier d'Etat. And um, anything else, any question you may have, let me know. Um, I was happy to talk to you uh, another 15 minutes or so and uh, I would say goodbye <laughs> <laughs> and see you next week.